internet. I'm even making milk today, Paya. Okay, no salt today. Eggs. Yes. Really need to get like bar stools for this area. This is getting really, really annoying and tiresome. Like every day I have to stand here and eat. <laughs> Come in here and eat. And sit and eat, <sighs> unfortunately. Your mattress is here! Your mattress is here! My mom's like, I'm not sharing the same room as you. I think you're gonna wake up in the middle of the night and like try to kill her or something. <laughs> no, we're moving it where it's supposed to be on my beautiful new bed frame that I got you for Mother's Day. Look, this is my mom's. Happy Shelby Barat from yesterday, guys. Okay, let's, let's do this. Uh, uh, I can't. I'm not very strong. I'm just having one of the gotcha mango bites. Hey, pretty girl. Hey, pretty girl. So I'm going to do like a quick uh, 10 minute mud mask. Um, the mask that I use is by Elizabeth Arden. I know it's not really like a great brand. I don't swear by Elizabeth Arden, so. <laughs> um, but this mask um, is, it's called a hydrating mask. Um, so yeah, and I, I, I do swear however by mud masks, so that's kind of why I recommend that we use the, um, that, that we use the mud masks because I tend to eat a lot of oily foods, um, and so that is so this mask is actually going to help in um, eliminating all this oil you know oiliness that I will get on my face and my skin and everything like so earlier I went ahead and I used toner um, all over my face because I was having some like acne problems here and here and like here um, which I mean I don't normally you know have an acne problem um, so the the toner kind of helps to even out the like the tone of my skin um, and then but I normally like I have like a little like sort of um, acne right here this is it's actually painful so um, but normally what I do with toner is I will like add it onto like a cotton swab um, just a little bit, um, not too much, and then I just like will um, kind of apply the toner all over and kind of scrub my face with the toner um, like for two minutes on all areas, kind of massage the, the skin on the face with the toner, especially on the areas where I feel like the acne is just, there's no point in the acne being there. It's not, you know, it's not hurting and it's just like kind of you know it's not even there on on my skin because the toner actually helps to, in reducing and ultimately eliminating that acne for me for example this right here it's just a red spot but if I apply toner over time it's going to reduce the redness and it, and eventually this and cause it to disappear um so yeah and then like for here like on my chin I used to have acne and stuff all over my chin and whenever the acne would go away I would still have kind of you know it looked like I still had acne but I didn't really have acne so I, I had to like look for a solution for that and um, the toner not only eliminated the acne on my chin it also um, made the marks kind of like greatly reduced 
so it was like kind of I don't know <laughs> it was awesome for me um, but yeah so um, I applied uh, toner all over here um, and I will just like take the cotton swab and I will massage it um, exactly where I have the problem um, for about two minutes all over. Now I'm going to go ahead and do my, um, my, my mud mask. So anytime that you're using this mud mask specifically, um, I would recommend using a uh, makeup brush. Um, or you can also do it with your fingers as well. I feel like the application is a lot cleaner um, with a makeup brush. Okay. Um, and so my cat is right here too. So he's just... <sighs> Give me this. Alright, so I'm going to be using this brush right here. Um, yeah. So I'm going to basically well first I like to make sure that they're nice and clean and then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to um, apply this all over the face and I'm going to leave it on for about 10 minutes la, 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 la. so I don't really do this mask very often so I have plenty of it just kind of in this tube um let's see how this works because I don't I don't think this is gonna work like this I like to have ooh, Prince move move it Prince get down get down boy go okay all right so um I'm gonna just go ahead and apply this with my fingers I don't think that the brush option is gonna work for me just because I feel like that brush specifically is actually like made to apply it's uh it's actually made to apply foundation prince get out of the way all right but it really doesn't take that long anyway so i'm just going to go ahead and just use my finger Uh, my problem areas are like right behind my nostrils. Um, so I do have to kind of apply, make sure that I apply some or concentrate some of the product back there. And then you can just like kind of, you don't have to rub it in or anything like that. You just have to um, leave it on there um, for, or you can just apply on like an even coat all over. It doesn't have to um, be too thick or too thick. Then you don't have to worry about that part. You just um, apply it on there. I'm going to use my mirror here real quick. Okay, so um, for this product, like I do like to um, focus it on areas where I have trouble with acne. So I will have it like all over my forehead. <laughs> no, just kidding. But I do have like the T-zone area. I also like to um, concentrate. Hold on, Prince. Oh. Okay. Um. Um, so I do like to concentrate it in my T-zone as well as my eyebrows, like actually inside my eyebrows, because I do tend to have 
acne there and it doesn't um yeah and so basically for me like I like to wash it really really often and um my eyebrows especially so this really really helps with that um I also have kind of problem areas like down the sides of my forehead as well like my face um, so I do like to concentrate this mask especially to that area. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and give this about 10 minutes and then I'm going to wash it off. Alright, so I just washed it off. Um, I think it was on there for about 10 minutes or so. Um, but yeah, and then like after washing it off, like I normally, for this mask especially, I don't um use any moisturizer afterwards so i like to let it do its own private special thing <laughs> um but yeah love this mask guys and so basically like the effects are immediate like i i mean obviously you don't want to be like touching your face all the time um <laughs> but like the like the oiliness is greatly reduced um so and i kind of feel wider but I think that's it's like why would I want to be even more white than I already am um, <laughs> but but yeah so it just feels like that really truly does even though like I, I wash my face every single day um, and I take really really especially good care of like my cleanliness and my hygiene um, yeah it's I don't know it does say like on the box like when I got when I got this product that it actually brings brightness so that's probably the the brightness part of it I mean some I mean some these are potato chips or they kind of look like potato wedges but um, these are fried in like canola oil there's no salt because the ketchup already contains salt and then or sodium and then round bread plain it's a pretty big round bread having a crunch bar so this is um, the the red lentils that we made yesterday or the other day, um, and this does contain sodium, milk, and a macadamia nut cookie. Um, so I actually um, got a position as a um, like what I do as a professional. Um, as a medical assistant um, so I did an interview um, and so basically you know they they liked me you know with my experience and everything like that so I did get hired on they did offer me so um, I did accept and um, so my start date was probably going to be tomorrow um but it's the only catch to it was that i would have to wait um until the clinic actually opened up um so um i was told by the physician that the um that the place would open up by tomorrow so my first date would technically be the 12th um but I still haven't heard back from them. <laughs> so I'm reorganizing this. Um, apparently it got like a little bit disorganized when I was in the move. Okay, so I kind of reorganized it. It should be a lot better. Now I can actually find stuff. Alright guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in again. Um, I'm going to go ahead and close the vlog. So um, please hit subscribe if you haven't already. Please like, share, and comment. And I will see you guys on the next one.